Welcome to Premath. In this video tutorial, we are going to find the factors of this given trinomial x power 4 plus x square plus 1. And here I have just copied down this expression right up here. And apparently we don't see any specific pattern to find the factor of this polynomial. Now somehow we wanted to use one of these formulas to find the factors of this given problem. And as we can see one of the formulas is sum of two cubes and the other formula is difference of two cubes. And if we focus on our this x power 4 we can write x power 4 as x power 3 times x power 1. Now let's go ahead and manipulate this problem a little bit. Let me go ahead and add x and at the same time I am going to subtract x as well. And as we can see that x minus x is 0 so it won't have any effect on this problem. Now in our next step let me go ahead and rearrange these terms. I'm going to write down x power 4 first and then I'm going to write down negative x and then I am going to write down plus x square then plus x and then plus 1. Now let's look at these first two terms as we can see that we can factor out x. If we factor out x, we ended up with x power 3 minus 1 and leave everything as it is plus x square plus x and then plus 1. Now let's focus on this part x power 3 minus 1. I have just copied it down over here x power 3 minus 1. 1 could be written as 1 power 3. And as we can see that we got a difference of 2 cubes. So therefore we are going to use this formula. The difference of 2 cubes, a cube minus b cube, it can be written as equal to a minus b time a square plus ab plus b square. In our case x is our a and 1 is our b. Let's go ahead and find the factors by using this effect. So this could be written as x minus 1 times x square plus x times 1 plus 1 square. And let's simplify a little bit more so we can write this one as x minus 1 times x square plus x and then 1 square is simply 1. Now let's shift our focus back to this our problem x times as we can see that x power 3 minus 1 we just factored it on this side. Let's go ahead and copy down this thing. This x power 3 minus 1 could be written as x minus 1 times x square plus x plus 1 and let's write down this whole thing as it is. I am going to write down plus x square plus x and then plus 1. And now we can see that this part x square plus x plus 1 is in common on these both sides. So we can factor this x square plus x plus 1 out. Let's go ahead and do that one. x square plus x plus 1 outside and in the bracket we are going to put down x time x minus 1 and over here on this side when we factor this one outside we are left with just simply 1 so I can write simply plus 1 right here. And we are almost finished. Let's go ahead and simplify a little bit more. So this is x square 
plus x and then plus 1 and let's go ahead and distribute this over here so that's going to give us x square this is minus x and then plus 1 and these are our complete factors of this given trinomial so thus our complete factors turn out to be x square plus x plus 1 time x square minus x plus 1 and that is our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye